Hey guys, what's up? Welcome to another video. In this video, we're going to be unboxing and taking a look at New Trends Airbender Mini 1.0 iPad mini case. This is a keyboard case. It's a clamshell case and uh, it is one of the new in the new Trent lineup and so let's go ahead and take a quick look at the box and as you can see it does say it fits the iPad mini only so if you're looking for uh, something for your Air or uh, um, one of the older iPod generation or iPad generations uh, check out some of my older videos I have some really cool cases also by Nutrient and some other manufacturers and as you can see this is a wireless Bluetooth keyboard again for the iPad mini we'll take a look at the back and as you can see it's durable protective 360 degree rotatable swivel stand uh, 180 degree support for the flip and it is only 20 millimeters uh, thick, so it's very, very thin, and it does say ultra thin. And uh, if you want the model number, guys, this is the NT520K. So let's go ahead and open this up and check it out. And as you can see also, guys, I want to point this out. Um, it has a color chart over here. This is the black version. You can get it in white, pink, and uh, I don't know if it says other, but maybe that's uh, something coming soon. So if you're a girl and you want a pink case, you can get this in pink. Uh, or if you're a guy and you want it pink, hey, that, I'm not judging. All right, so as you can see, here we have out of the box, so you're just like the little clamshell case, and we have uh, very nice packaging. Oh, this is very nice, guys. Um, we'll open this here in a sec. Uh, so we have in the box an instruction booklet. So you can see the user manual and then we also have just a micro USB cable for charging the device and that is all we've got in the box guys so let's toss the box aside and let's take a look at the product itself put that back in the picture here all right here we have the iPad mini case a very very nice matte black finish um, very very smooth, feels good in the hands. Uh, it's got a couple little very tiny rubber feet uh, to try to keep it from slipping on any kind of surface on the bottom side. Um, then on the top we have uh, in cut for the camera and all your ports, a microphone. Then on the bottom we have the actual charger for the keyboard and then uh, an open area so you can get to your lightning adapter and speakers on your mini so let's go ahead and open this up and it uh, feels really nice really nice this actually feels kind of like a a netbook would feel um, if you had a tiny little netbook this is very sturdy very nice product um, so let's go ahead and I'll pick it up guys as you can see your iPad mini is going to fit right in there I currently do not have my iPad mini therefore I cannot put this in but uh, it looks like all the uh, holes and stuff are going to line up just right very very sturdy build up top here um, and then here we have the keyboard as you can see you've got like uh, some lock, battery, bluetooth um, pairing on and off, let me just turn this on, it's got a little bit of charge probably out of the gate there you can see we've got some lights uh, to indicate that uh, what's going on and you can put this in pairing mode and uh, really nice chiclet keys, I'll turn on the caps lock nothing's going on there uh, you know, so it's got a nice feel to it, um, definitely, so let's shut this off. Now, one of the nice features of Nutrient keyboards is that the cases, as you can see, I can flat, pretty much lay that out flat, clamshell it closed, and then it does have a 360 degree swivel, so you can see we can do this kind of number, you can use your iPad mini like this where I have the back basically covering the keyboard so if you want to just hold it and read you can do it both directions so that's a really nice feature you know if you wanted to just have it like this there's a lot of different options for you guys so say you're keying um, and you want to have it kind of like this and key so you could see kind of at an angle I don't know maybe you got another item over here that you're keying or something and you want your mini maybe you're just viewing it but uh, a lot of different uh, things you can do with this. Close it up. And uh, this is a, just like I said, really nice thing. I, I like that it's got a matte finish. It does not produce fingerprints. Uh, so that's a win. 
Um, and it's like I said, it's just a really nice sturdy design, guys. Uh, as you can see, it's very, very heavy when I set that down. So, uh, a real win. I think this is a good case. I can't wait to get my Mini back in um, and put this in here and give it a try uh, and see. It's kind of... This is the one thing, that, I don't know if those rubber feet are quite big enough. Um, I was kind of concerned when I saw that. It does kind of slide on a surface. So if I had to see a negative right out of the box, guys, I think this is kind of a negative that it is a little bit prone to slide. Um, I think they might want to put a few bigger feet on this just to make it so it doesn't slide around on a slick surface like this. So that's about the only negative I can come out of this, this with, guys, until I get my iPad mini in this and start using it. Um, that is about it. I uh, hope you enjoyed the video. Again, this was the new Trent um, Airbender Mini 1.0 uh, for your iPad Mini. Um, check the show notes. I'll have a link in it for where you can pick this up. It's a really good price uh, for this type of product. Um, other cases like this are going to run you a lot more. So for the quality and everything for the price point, this is a win. This is a great, great product. And uh, I would recommend it, guys. So if you enjoyed this video, give me a thumbs up. And uh, again, check the show notes. If you have comments, questions, whatever, feel free to put them in there. And feel free to share and like this video. And the subscription to the channel also, guys. And I will continue to produce some good quality uh, reviews. Again, I'll, I'll do a follow-up with this with the iPad Mini in it. Um, real short one, so be watching for that, guys, so I can do a little more demonstrations on how this works with the iPad Mini, and we'll do, like, the uh, pairing and all that kind of stuff, and uh, see how that works. So, anyway, guys, thanks for watching. Have a good one.